I'm exploiting my family this time. <laughs> so I've got my wife Bronnie on violin. Yeah. Three. Yeah. Um, my brother Mikey on drum. Yeah. Just singular, not plural, just drum. <laughs> and Sophie and Beth are on felt people. Now, uh, a few years ago, I was sitting at my desk and I was trying to think of an idea for a story, which I do pretty much all the time, but I just couldn't think of anything. I was sitting there and I had a blank white piece of paper in front of me and I didn't have any, any ideas. And then, out of nowhere, a boy just landed on the page in front of me and he had a little brown hat on and a striped shirt on and I didn't know who he was or where he came from, but I told him to stay there and I drew some pictures around him and I turned him into a story. And that's the boy on the page. Now, as I drew these pictures around the boy on the page, he sang a little song to me. And this is what he sang. I'm ready. I've landed on this page and there's no one else around From where I fell, I'm afraid I cannot tell I don't know my name or age I am the boy on the page But there's comfort to be found in these animals that now surround a penguin, a giraffe, a pig to make me laugh, a small bird to lead the way. I am the boy on the page. One question then appears, why am I here? It's such a big white space, and each page that I face I just can't find my place. I am the boy on the page, I am the boy 